Hi guys, it's me, Blanket Gamer 1000 here, back with another low quality video. And in this video, I'm going to be doing something a little different from what I usually do. Um if you guys if, if you guys know Luke the Notable, then that's great. Luke the Notable is an 100-day Minecraft hardcore YouTuber and he started off doing some other things, but we're not going to get into that. Basically, what I'm here to tell you about is his Minecraft 100 Days End in hardcore mode, of course. But not just not that in particular. Actually, we're going to be talking about the torch. This thing that maybe some of you have seen and wondered how did he get it, stuff like that. It is pretty simple, so let's get into it. Watch this clip. Fruit entryway. Got some coarse fruit on the side, of the, side of the house, too. The house too. It's great it's decoration. Great decoration. For, the end, For the end, I'm still working, I'm still on, the working on the outside, polishing up little, up little things, things that no one would that notice, notice but me. me. Bro, bro, how do you get a torch? You, you never talked about the torch. He's definitely cheating. He went creative. I saw Then did some deforestation. So, as you can see there, he pointed it out himself, even though he was joking about that. Um, he definitely did seem to um, point out that the torch was there. So, now you guys are like, okay, well, how did he actually get the torch? So, if we go over, if we go back, actually, to... Um, like there. But now, but full now of end stone, it's time to build my build road my into the voidiest into the part of the void. Oh, if I fall off, I'm dead. But, you know, there's more time in the video, so you probably know that doesn't happen. After going for a pretty long while, sometime on day 55, I could see the Ender Dragon Island. Oh, there's the dragon! Just as my road got to the edge of the island, my lights went out. Not sure what this is, but I don't want to test it. I'm definitely going to need a safe way to get down there, and I think I have a pretty good idea. I dropped to the end island 100 times, and this is what happened. I instantly dug underground. How smart of me. Here's the plan. And now, guys, as you can see here, um, he has four torches in his inventory, along with a lot of other things, like his tools, healing potions, and end of and stuff like that so when you look at it <laughs> he has four torches and um he has four torches and that's very cool um and you're okay so and because when you go further into the video he places down the torches and stuff like that um he places one of the torches down on his house but he probably, and you're like, okay, well, how did he get them? Well, the Ender Dragon Island actually spawned <laughs> with um, torches. So he must have put one of the torches down and still had three. So, yeah, that's basically how he got the three, the four torches, by going to the Ender Dragon Island um, and taking the torches without even killing the Ender Dragon yet. So I hope this summed it up to you guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye.